Welcome back to Singer Dad Reacts. My name is Josh, and welcome to all of you uh, So Hyung uh, fans out there. Um, I'm a huge fan, actually, of hers, and I love her voice. Um, it's one of my favorites of, of all of the performers that I've reacted to on my channel. Uh, I go back and watch her performances all the time and, and really enjoy her voice, and so I'm excited about this reaction. Ever since I did uh, my reaction to uh, Morissette Ammon singing Never Enough, I wanted to come and, and uh, also uh, see So Hyung's uh, performance of the same song. So um, I try not to compare artists because I know everybody's got uh, their favorites and uh, which reminds me. So for those of you making comments out there, um, I just had to kind of, you know, speak boldly to someone that had been putting comments and, and, and what they've been doing is basically going in and, and kind of putting putting other artists down in the comments for that particular reaction so coming into another reaction for a different artist putting that artist down and saying in this case Dimash was better than all of them and you know, this and that so um, that's not really in um, good spirits for my channel so um, if you're going to uh, go in and insult another artist and lift up your own favorite artist or whatever that's that's not uh, really what my channel is all about so um, if you feel strongly about your artist feel free to you know put their praise in, in in the comments for my reaction to them um, that's perfectly okay and and proper and i would expect that but don't go and insult other artists and tell you know because in and this is what i told this particular person uh, Dimash especially would not want his fans to do that uh, because he's all about being kind and learning from others and lifting others and you know all of those things so he would not want his dears uh, acting like that so in any case let's be kind let's keep it positive uh, so it's coming back to comparing so I'm not going to if you're hoping for me to say okay I like this performance of Never Enough better than the other one. And I'm not really going to do that um, because every artist is different. So I might like certain aspects of of what one artist does in their rendition of the song. And then I might like another thing that another artist does in their rendition of the song. So that's that's kind of the way I look at it. You know, each artist brings their own uniqueness, their own style to each of their covers and their performances. And so, um, I just am interested in kind of seeing how how they do it differently and how they perform it and, and make it their own and bring the feeling of the song to it. And segueing from that, so I'm going to read the lyrics here. Um, so this is Never Enough. I'm trying to hold my breath, let it stay this way, can't let this moment end. You set off a dream in me, getting louder now, can you hear it echoing? Take my hand. Will you share this with me? I can't help but think of the melody as I'm reading the lyrics here. Because uh, darling, without you, all the shine of a thousand spotlights, all the stars we steal from the night sky will never be enough. Never be enough. Towers of gold are still too little. These hands could hold the world, but it'll never be enough. Never be enough for me. And then it goes on, never enough. All the shine of a thousand spotlights, all the stars we steal from the night sky will never be enough. Towers of gold are still too little. These hands could hold the world, but it'll never be enough. So then it repeats the chorus. Um, so yeah, it's a beautiful song, powerful song. And I'm excited to see uh, So Hyung's uh, version of it. So without further ado, let's jump right into it here. Got it all keyed up. And for those new to my channel, or if you haven't already, if you could please uh, subscribe and click the notifications bell uh, so that you can be notified of any new reactions that I have that you may be interested in, I would appreciate that. And also, if you could check out my Patreon, um, I do have some updated uh, pricing there, and also I'm updating some of the, the benefits. So take a look and uh, something there as far as the benefits that you may be able to receive such as early access or being able to vote on what I react to. Uh, 
may be of interest to you. So if you could go check that out, I'd appreciate it. It's patreon.com slash singerdadreacts. So let's jump into this here. That's very colorful. I'm trying to hold my breath Let it stay this way Can't let this moment end You set off a dream with me Getting loud now Can you hear it echoing? Share this with me Cause darling without you Yeah, so I have to say so far she just sounds She sounds different from some of the other songs that I've heard her sing And it just goes to show that she truly is remarkable as far as her ability to Um change the timbre and the feel of uh, the, the the sound and the quality and the resonance and the all of that as far as it relates to her instrument she has full control over changing all of that when she needs to for a given performance um, and so it doesn't surprise me that she's able to do this and, and have it kind of sound different from a lot of the other songs that she's done um, because she has as much as anyone I've seen full control of her of her instrument, but so far it sounds amazing, and just the whole like the staging that she did here is really is really cool. Uh, sitting in this massive chair, um, I'm wondering what the story is behind that. So if any of you have any ideas or thoughts around what um, or information about why she chose this with the large dress and kind of sitting there in this setting please let me know in the comments let's get back to it here all the shine of thousand spotlights all the stars but still from the night nice ah, she's in a different never setting never be enough <laughs> oh, wow never be enough That's tons cool. of gold cause still too little this hands could hold the world those harmonies. She's amazing. She is just... I just love her voice. It's just so pure and resonant. The, and I've said this before about her pitch. Her pitch is right on. Um, she's never off pitch in the slightest. Um, so like I have relative pitch basically, which is... Uh, which means it's not perfect pitch, but I can hear like, like if someone's about an eighth of a step or so flat or sharp, I can hear, I can hear that it's off. And so it's, which makes it kind of hard, you know, when I'm listening to performances and stuff, because sometimes, you know, someone else next to me might really be enjoying it because they can't really hear that the, that the person is off. And so they'll just kind of listen to it and, and, you know, think it's great and all that. And, and for me, it's, it's a little different because I can hear, you know, if they're a little bit off and things like that. So it kind of takes away from the performance sometimes. But there's no need of that of, of for me to worry at all with So Hyung because she's always, you know, 
dead on. I think I've talked about it before. She's actually on the top part of the pitch. So she's not sharp. She's not above that particular note, but she's at the top part of of that particular uh, pitch that she, whatever she's singing. Um, instead of kind of being on the bottom where it's like you start to question, oh, are they flat? You know, it just doesn't sound as, as pure and rich. Um, she's always right on top. Um, and I love how she's doing this whole thing where she has herself there as well with kind of a different look, singing the harmonies. Uh, yeah, this I'm loving this arrangement. Let me go back a little bit here. Make sure I don't miss anything. Never for me, for me. Wide open she is. For me, for me, for me. All the shine of thousand spotlights, all the stars we steal from the night sky. Never be enough, never be enough. Tells of clouds are still. Oh, wow, she's adding another part. Right together, too. That is awesome. So I was not expecting that. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't surprise me that she broke it out and did something completely unique and and had eventually three different parts going. Um, but yeah, I wasn't expecting that. Um, and again, it just shows her versatility. Um, that she could create those layers and make them right together. One of the parts that was really cool, so and it's harder than you would actually guess. And I didn't stop and, and mention it, but when one and one of her likenesses um, sang together unison, so that's actually harder than you would think to record yourself singing a melody two different times and then have those be exactly the same and together completely. Um, it's it's harder than than you would think so i'm very impressed by her arrangement and having these layers and these different parts and she did different um never enoughs there at the very end so some were high some were doing the never never you know and so that was just really cool and it all fit well with what was being saying so so uh it was all just kind of you know layered in there uh, nicely and the harmonies and everything so um, definitely one of my favorite uh, covers for this song and yeah I love it she just she continues to create masterpieces uh, every every song that I've seen her uh, sing now I just love for different reasons and she just puts her stamp on it and her voice is just so angelic and 
Um, yeah, she's amazing. I could listen to her all the time. You know, I just she's one of those artists that I just really love to listen to. So, yeah, that that was that was awesome. Thank you for recommending that. I'm glad you did. I'm glad I I reacted to it. Now I can go back, as I've mentioned before, and listen to it. You know, many times as I do with other artists. Once I hear their particular song, uh, it's always nice to be able to kind of go back and listen to that again. Uh, what makes it hard is when I want to listen to other songs from that artist, but yet I need to kind of hold back and wait until I've had a chance to react to it, and so I can share that with with all of you. So keep the recommendations coming for So Young, and uh, I have a few more on my list. Uh, I think. Um, Misty was one of them, Amazing Grace, um, and there were a couple others. But if you have some of your favorites that you'd like to recommend, put those down in the comments. And if you haven't already, if you could please subscribe. Um, and thank you again for your support, and take care.